Entering and managing purchase orders in Dynamics GP is pretty straightforward. It's easy to do. Let's take a look at it. The first thing you do is go to the purchasing area page here, and then I go to purchase order entry. In purchase order entry, I can enter new purchase orders, but also look up existing purchase orders that have not yet been received. So let's enter a new purchase order here. I'm going to tap through. The system will give me a PO number, and let's take a look. We'll look up a vendor ID here. Here's a vendor I want to use. So this is a purchase order to a specific vendor. I'm going to tab down into the, the line area here. Here I can add as many lines as I want to. They can be inventory items or non-inventory items. Let me do a lookup and add some items here. I'm going to add this item here. When I do that, it's going to bring in that item number from the inventory master file. And I'm going to select my quantity. I want to get 100 of these. The system will suggest a price, which is the price that you lost last bought this from this particular vendor. Um, and then let's tab a little further. I want to put a site ID in here. This is just the inventory location. It's a required field. So um, I'm just going to look up my site ID here and enter that. If I want to, I can add additional items to this particular PO. Once I'm done with this PO, it's easy to print out. I can just click on the printer here. It'll print out a copy of this purchase order. I can also send it via email to my vendor if this is set up just by clicking on this document.